it is uh it's getting a little late i'm i'm actually really tired but um i wanted to do a quick update video i actually recorded twice a uh a review of the new star trek movie and um i don't i don't know why my editing app is just not taking it and i think it might be due due to the length or something um but i'm trying to figure that out but in the meantime i've recorded this thing twice and uh I'm not getting anywhere with it. So I will almost definitely re-record it. I'll try to be less long-winded about it. But if you subscribe to my channel, you know that's going to be hard for me. So I might have to split it like into two or something. Um, but I kind of want to do this update video. And um, I got thinking about it while I was listening to um, an old EP uh, by a... Um, it was a, it was a, I believe a local Houston band at the time. Um, I got the thing through my mother, um, who was friends with the mother of one of the band members or something. And, uh, and she gave it to me and, uh, it very quickly became one of my, one of my favorite discs. And I think I've listened to that thing a hundred times. Uh, and, um, it's it's really really good <laughs> and um uh you know I, I as far as i know it's the only thing the band ever did the, the band was called the point um the ep was called ep um yeah i probably would have called it something else but i'm long way to draw titles the album is very profound and it and it and it has a, a tone to it that is, um, I mean, just very accomplished. And they managed to balance this really kind of melancholy tone, um, but infused it with great hope. And um, the it, it's something I like. I really do like to listen to in times like this. Um, you know, there are times. There are times when you're just accomplishing a lot and, you know, it, things are falling into place and there, there are times when you're not accomplishing a lot and things are falling apart. And then there are times that you just feel like you're spinning your wheels. And it's not even uh, in, and sometimes you are, sometimes you actually are spinning your wheels, but sometimes you're actually not and um you're you're actually getting to a point where everything's falling into place but it's just you're all on the cups cusp of that and um that's kind of where where i felt like for a while I'm, i've been studying for my series six exam and i'm now two days from taking it and i feel like i've been in that book for years now um and it's coming to an end and that that's just making me be in the book more and um and at, at this point you know you just you want it just to get it behind you and you know almost i mean to the point that i'm not even thinking about what we can do with this license what comes next but just to the point of i just want to be done with a stupid test um, it is on the same day I am taking the splint off and, um, you know, I'm able to do more and more with my thumb all the time and it's feeling better and better and better. And, um, it's, you know, I'm now two days away from getting the splint off. So it's pretty much healed. Um, I just, you know, need to be working on soon range of motion and blah 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 but i've been wrapping this stupid thing so long now that again it feels like i'm not getting anywhere with it and assuming i pass this test it's like going to be really interesting because on the same day i'm going to be like really getting over to giant humps and um getting through them and 
all you know all this time I've spent it's going to prove that I haven't been spinning my wheels but right now right now I feel like this is all I'm doing um I've been really thankful for actually the the writing challenge if you've been keeping up with my videos on that I've actually been really thankful for that uh just because it, it has let me just be able to see some progress in something, even though I haven't been spending very long on it. Uh, yesterday, I I just uh, I spent a lot longer than I intended to. It wasn't it wasn't really long. It wasn't even an hour. It was you know maybe a half hour, forty minutes on my story, and just kind of um, just churned out the uh, the last section of the plot and uh, wrapped up the first draft, and that's you know just the way i the way i write and edit that's not yet half of what i need to do with it but it's the really the biggest the biggest moment of accomplishment because even when i'm finished editing it it doesn't feel as good as finishing a rough draft knowing that the story is told now i'm just nitpicking the way i'm telling the story but the story is told. And um, so uh, yesterday was really, really cool for that. Uh, I was editing more today and um, not, again, not very long. I was uh, basically just adding a, a couple hundred words here and there. Um, when I edit, my stories get longer. They don't get shorter at all. Um, uh, so I think I got through a couple of, of the first scenes um, in editing. Uh, so it's good progress. And um, I'm, yeah, overall very thankful that I got to do that. Um, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm ready to get back to working my normal job in my normal patterns. And I'm ready to get back to the goals that I have set for my office and, um, you know, taking care of customers and stuff, the stuff that I've just been having to give to, to other people there. Cause I've been so, um, neck deep in, in serious sick stuff. Um, and so, uh, I am very excited for Friday. Um, but uh, until then, uh, since I'm not going to, I'm not going to be uploading this video tonight. Um, my exam is on Thursday, uh, which is the 11th, and it's in the morning. And uh, I'll try to report back on how I did uh, as soon as possible. But um, Friday, it's kind of back to the, to the normal routine and um, back to you know, focusing on, on, on the stuff that actually does, uh, does have an impact on, um, kind of the day-to-day -day operation stuff instead of, uh, all the background stuff of licensing and things. So in the meantime, um, I guess the consolation of, of this time, uh, just spinning, spinning wheels is that, you know, I, I don't feel like I can see kind of the light at the end of the tumble tunnel, even though it's almost here. Um, but I do know it's coming. And uh, at least on, an, you know, I, from an intellectual point of view, I do know the progress I'm making. I do recognize it. I, I, I don't feel it. I don't. I, I don't feel like I've accomplished a lot, but I know that I have. And um, so uh, hopefully Thursday's going to prove the, uh, the the truth of that. And it's all going to, to suddenly come together. And I'm again going to feel accomplished. Um, or, or I guess I could fail the test. And. Yeah, and then really feel like I've been spinning my wheels, but we'll um, 
just have to wait and see. Um, for my viewers who are Christian, if you uh, wouldn't mind praying for my exam, if you do see this before the exam, if you see it afterwards, you know, feel free to still pray for me, but, uh, you know, maybe about my business or something like that. Um, but until then, thank you all for watching. I'll talk to you later. Thank you.